Gianna, I think that was a really signature swim for you in, in backstroke. You know, being able to, to go 57-9 and get it under 28 on the opener and under 30 on the closer, how huge of a swim can this be for you going into February? Um, I've never like brought my race back under 30, so that was like my goal, and I'm like really happy that I got 57. And I think I can get a little bit faster and hopefully get down to 56 by district. You know, obviously you had that really nice performance at Viking. Is it fair to say that you've been able to really kind of build off that, you know, from that meet, going on to practices and meets, obviously, and heading into this one as well? Starting um, the year with a 58-1 was, like, super big for me, and I think I've been able to, like, like I was very motivated after that, and now 57 is going to be even better to work off that, so I'm really excited practice and hopefully get that You mentioned it, the importance of getting under 30 on that back end. Is there any one key that really makes that happen and do you feel like you can push it maybe a little further than that? Um, I definitely like Sometimes I'm scared to like go out really fast and going 27 just like, I don't know, it was like a really good balance and I, was, I don't know, I just like good I guess. <laughs> And you know, it, you know, we talk about it all the time, but being able to have you know Sarah head to head, I gotta imagine, really helps push your times as well, right? I love to be against her. She's like one of my biggest competitions, and it was really good to finally win and get a PR. So I'm really excited about that. Sounds.